Hey, this is Asha. Welcome to another episode here on Backstage Income, where I share with you how to build and grow a profitable business. Now, in today's episode, I want to share with you some of the things behind the scenes, what we're doing, and I'm upgrading some lights and batteries. We're going to talk about these batteries. These are the Castar batteries. Sony MPF batteries, if you've never heard about them, stick around. I'm going to give you some more insight about them. All right, so this is the battery that you'll get if this is something that you're gonna order. Uh, a couple of quick little factoids about it that if you go ahead and press the check button, you have this uh, little LED panel that shows you how far charged they are. You also have a way to charge it through a micro USB port or cable. And then you also have on the other side a power bank. So this is great for USBs if you're looking to charge your phone. And it does work, it is charging my phone right now. Uh, testing with the Pixel 2 right here, you can see there it is charging. Testing with the Pixel 2, it takes about uh, 90 minutes to charge it up. Uh, initially when you plug it in from full dead, it says about 55, 60 minutes, uh, but then uh, by the time it was done, it took actually about 70, 80, 90 minutes. So it took you know a little bit more time than it said, but otherwise, those are the cool three factoids behind it. I'll show you some um, insight where you can get these things but uh, and the price. Really, if you look for Sony MPF batteries right here, uh, they're about $22, $21 a piece in a pack of two, uh, which is really a pretty good deal in my opinion because the batteries do last for quite a long time, especially if you're using them with lights. There's also another version of this. There's a power extra, but the MA rating or milliamp hours here rating is a little bit less. So that one is 6,600 and the ones that I got from Castar is 8,700. Now, Maybe there's some better chips or technologies in the other ones. How far they last, I'm not sure. They could be very similar, but nevertheless, these are doing quite well. So this is a secondary option for you, um, especially if your lights don't have a battery check or battery power check on a LCD panel or something to that effect. Uh, so that's why these batteries are fantastic. The one big difference I've noticed with the Power Extra, at least from what I saw, is when looking at it, you do have that USB charger as a power pack, but on the other side, you can't charge it that way. You do have that DC out, which you can see right there. So you could plug these in from a DC um, input, but it doesn't look like you can go ahead and charge those from, from USB. And that's why I like this Castar batteries, because with these, what you can do is you can go ahead and charge them uh, from the micro USB. So what I went ahead and did, if you go ahead and check these out, I went ahead and purchased something like this. This is a, a RAV Power. This is a six port USB charger, and this is 60 watts. So it's got quite a lot of juice behind it where every port's like, uh, 2.4 amps or 2 amps and higher and that's what you want when you're charging big batteries otherwise you could do it with a 1 amp but it's going to start overheating it uh, you know those cheap other chargers so what you can do is you can plug this in right here when you plug that in it'll start charging it I don't have this plugged in right now uh, but you could plug a bunch of these batteries in and charge them through USB or even from your computer it's really not going to be a problem um, and you just charge up your batteries on the go from anywhere or even a car and that's the cool part about it that's why I got this to be able to do the charging this way because you know buying uh, a bunch of other little chargers uh, that you plug in and you hook into the wall all that stuff is just more stuff to have and it's really annoying so anyways I went ahead and got one of these if you want to check that out uh, for the USB bank I'll show you it's uh, when you go and check out on Amazon uh, it is basically a uh, six port USB charger and they have a bunch of different ones available right there I'll link to one or two of them below uh, but here's the RAV power one that I got a lot of good reviews again 60 watts so each port is very strong there's some others out there uh, remember if you're getting something that's less wattage you're probably going to be doing a, a smaller uh, charge on some of those ports so kind of um, when you look at some of these you'll note that uh, some of these ports are outlined like, okay, that's a quick charge maybe, and others are kind of slower charge. So you have to be careful when buying these things because you want to make sure that it's strong enough to feed it. It's not that it won't work, it's just they'll be a bit slower. So anyways, that's the cool part about these um, batteries. And really, how do I use them? And why do you want to get these Sony NPF batteries? Um, ultimately, for me, 
I like to just go ahead and if you have some kind of light or LED light, especially if you're doing videos or something to fill in, uh, you know, you could get something like this. You got a light, boom, and these things will hold these smaller lights for hours, five, six hours uh, without recharge. So it's pretty great and amazing. And this right here, this LCD doesn't have a battery checker. So there's, there's no way. It's just you change the color temperature or the percentage and value of the strength of the light. So that's the cool part about this, these batteries, is you could just go ahead and check how strong or powered up they are. Now, certain other panels, like here's a newer uh, LED light panel. This is the 480 version, not the 660. But I could go ahead and plug just one of these in. I'll go ahead and plug it over here on this side and flip it on. This one and this panel actually does have a battery indicator. So these batteries, this check is not really needed. Um, and, you know, so some of these more premium lights, they have their own battery checker, but on other lights, they don't. So regarding the other lights, it's fantastic to have this battery check if you want to just go ahead and see the battery itself. But for panels like this, the battery check is not as needed. But what, what is great is I could still go ahead and when this light is off, I could go ahead and plug it in and just charge it right there. So, you know, I'll turn it off, plug that into it, and this battery will start charging it and boom, and then I'm good to go. And of course, you could go ahead and pop two of these batteries, which will last you many, many hours to come. I'd say at least a handful of hours, uh, three to four hours uh, with two batteries, I mean, you're probably looking for, you know, four hours or so, not at full blast, but you know, on average use. Uh, so definitely huge, huge power within these batteries, but they are, they are big. They're, they're not small. They're, they're pretty good, good size. And the weight I'd say, you know, a couple of cell phones right there, one or two cell phones right there in your hands. So anyways, that's just my thoughts and takes, um, on these, uh, batteries. I think if you're dealing any kind of videos, a lot of stuff is moving to these Sony MPF batteries. Of course, you could go ahead and plug your lights in directly into the wall, um, you know, DC port or other connectors. Uh, but if you're looking for some convenience, you're traveling in the car, you want to go ahead and plug a regular USB in your car charger and plug these batteries in, you're on the go, videographer, photographer, uh, you know, or you're just traveling, that's a good way to do it. So, Anyways, thank you so much for joining me and sticking with me. Feel free to subscribe to the YouTube channel by clicking the button here or join me on my newsletter list by going over here, enter your name and email address, and I'll send you some free goodies as they get released. Thanks again for sticking with me, and I'll see you next time.